Good morning, This it is Thursday and this is vlog 4. Today I have two uh, lectures and then I've got a supervision uh, for Roman law uh, this afternoon. So a busy day but nonetheless an important day. So I shall see you later. So I had my lectures for tort and criminal, criminal looking at the mens rea and tort looking at negligence and breach of duty, both are very interesting. Um, I had my lunch uh, at the Sidbury site which is where the law faculty is, that's where I had my lectures. Uh, and then I went to Weatherspoons for a dessert which was nice. And I also went shopping, got a few things that I needed to get. And now I'm just going to come to my room, get myself sorted and make sure I'm all prepared for the supervision for civil law which is at Clare Hall. So I shall see you later. So I am back from my supervision for civil law. Uh, that was at Clare Hall. It did overrun by 30 minutes, but it was still really good and very helpful. It did clarify a few things. We were able to ask supervised questions and he asked us questions back. So that was good. Um, I've come back to college, about to have a nice sandwich to eat. And then I've got quite a bit of criminal law work that I would like to get on with. And then we'll see what happens later on. So I shall see you later. So I managed to get quite a bit done in the library for criminal law, which is fantastic. And then afterwards I ended up watching a film uh, with my friend uh, whilst we ate some chocolates. So that was lovely. It was just a nice way of ending off the day. So yes, it's been quite busy today. It's going to be quite busy uh, tomorrow, but I'll tell you more about that uh, tomorrow. So I shall see you tomorrow. Good morning. It is Friday. It's quite a busy day today. We've got three lectures and uh, constitutional taught and civil and then afterwards there is uh, a tutorial on mooting and mooting is basically an opportunity to, in a, it's in a sim simulated uh, court and just an opportunity to like practice those skills develop those skills that um you'll you know if you do decide to practice the law that you will uh, need so it's going to be quite interesting to go to that there are uh, something out of cambridge there are a lot of uh, opportunities to take part in mooting both uh, in your college and on a university level um, you know against other colleges or even against other universities uh, but yes I'll go to this tutorial just to get those uh, basic ideas and then I can decide what to do from there so yes quite a busy day but quite an important day as well so I shall see you later so I had my lectures for taught civil and constitutional taught covered uh, negligence and causation uh, constitutional covered like things like rule of law and separation of powers and uh, civil law covered property so looking at kind of like the Roman laws of property which was very interesting I then had that uh, tutorial on mooting afterwards so they, it was by the law Cambridge University Law Society so they went through kind of like what's it about or how would you need to prepare for it and things like that and so I've signed up for the event for the first set of uh, mooting that will be happening soon, just for beginners, it's designed for beginners, um, you know, uh, so that you can be taught and have the experience needed. So that'll be good. Um, so I'm heading back to college now, uh, probably have something to eat and then get on with uh, some work. to get some more work done for constitutional law which was good and then we decided to go to the local pub and we just had a couple of drinks in there and then we went to Weatherspoons after just for a little bit but then I, I decided to come back because I was a, a bit tired and uh, it's been quite a busy day today but a very important day nonetheless. Uh, tomorrow there's no lectures or, or um, supervisions but there is quite a lot of work that I need to get on with. So I'll probably be getting on with that tomorrow. Uh, so I shall see you tomorrow. Good morning, it is Saturday. Um, I've got quite a bit of preparation to do for next week. So quite a lot of criminal and constitutional law preparation. Uh, especially since I've got my criminal law supervision next Wednesday. So quite a lot to do, but I'm sure I'll get it uh, done. So I will catch you later.
to the library, managed to get some of the criminal law and the constitutional law work done, which is good. I've come back to my room and I'm going to have a sandwich. Again, I know, but I do like my sandwiches, so I'll have that. Just have a little rest and then get on with some more work this afternoon. So I managed to get some more work done in the library and now I'm just working on my essays. I've got one criminal law essay due in for the day after the criminal law supervision on Wednesday. So I'm just planning today and then writing up, uh, starting to write up tomorrow. Uh, later on, uh, we're going to be, as a group of friends, we're going to be in the kitchen making something to, uh, for our dinners, which will be lovely. And then afterwards, I think we're going to try and get out somewhere, maybe to Weather Spoons, uh, maybe something else, but we're not too sure yet. So yes, it's been, it's been a, a busy day, a lot to, uh, to do, but uh, hopefully uh, it'll be nice, a little more relaxing tonight. So we end up making sweet and sour chicken, which was delicious, and then afterwards we went to Weatherspoons uh, for some drinks and uh, for some dancing, which was fantastic. We were there quite a while, but it was lovely. Uh, as I'm back at college now, I'm going to get some sleep because I've got quite a bit of work that I need to get done. So I shall see you uh, tomorrow. Good morning, it is Sunday, and here we are in the laundry room for the weekly laundry segment of the vlog. My bag is got there, full of clothes, ready to put in the washing machine. Got the two pound, so I'll put the money in, I'll put the clothes in, I'll put, I'll put the, t uh, the tablet in, and then I've got to wait 36 minutes. So I shall see you in 36 minutes time. So approximately 36 minutes later, the clothes are ready, I'll hang them up in my room, and then I'll probably get on with some work in the library. So I'm just going to get on with some questions, and then hopefully we'll start writing up some of the essays that I need to write up. So I shall see you later. So I managed to get uh, quite a bit of my uh, criminal essay done. It's not fully complete, there's still quite a bit to do, but I've got a, a large amount of it done, which is good. I'm um, about to soon head off to brunch uh, at 12, which will be delicious, and then I'll get on with some more work this afternoon. So I got some more constitutional work done in the library, which is good, and then I came back and had some dinner. It was a sandwich again, but it was a nice uh, sandwich. Uh, and now I've just finished off my criminal essay, well, the first draft at least, I'll go through it before I need to hand it in, just to make sure there's no spelling errors or things like that, just to check that I've got everything in. Um, I think t tonight we're just going to go to the Griffin, which is like just a place where you can have some drinks, it's at, in the college ground, so that'll be nice, and then uh, I'll be getting re uh, go to bed, I guess I do need to get some sleep uh, for lectures that are on tomorrow, so I shall see you later. So the Griffin Bar was unfortunately closed, but we were able to go into the buttery and have some drinks and chat in there, which was lovely. I've come back to my room. I'm about to go to bed now because I've got two lectures on tomorrow, one for tour and one for constitutional. So quite a busy day. I've got quite a bit of work I need to get on with. So I shall see you tomorrow. Good morning. It is Monday. Today I have two lectures, a tour lecture and a constitutional lecture. And then afterwards, I think I'll be planning to stay at the Squires Law Library and get on with some constitutional work. And then afterwards, I have a couple of things I might need to do, and then we'll see what happens from there. So I shall see you later. So I've had my lectures for tort law and constitutional tort. We continued on with negligence and causation. And for constitutional, we continued on with the rule of law. Um, and then I went to the library afterwards and managed to get my constitutional law work done, which is good. Well, I've managed to get the reading done at least. I've got some the essay I need to do later on. So I'm heading into town to get a few things, some food, bits and pieces, and then I'll get back to college to get on with some work. So I did some shopping, I got some food in, and I also got an umbrella. And the reason why I've got an umbrella is because I've lost the other one. I don't know where it's gone, so I've decided to get another one. And if, it t if one turns up, then I'll have two. So I've managed to get an umbrella, and I've managed to get a little sandwich box because I thought it would be nice to make some sandwiches and take them up to the Sidwick site which is where the law faculty is. So yes, I'm going to have my dinner now, watch a bit of The Good Wife and then get on with my essay for constitutional law. So I managed to get quite a bit of the constitutional essay done. I haven't finished all of it um, but I've managed to get a good amount done so that's good and I was able to do some of my, uh, make some notes for tort law as well. So yeah, it's been quite a busy day, but quite a productive day as well. And it's going to be an even more busy day tomorrow because it's free lectures, uh, but they're nonetheless free, very important lectures. So I shall see you tomorrow. 
Good morning, it is Tuesday and today is quite a busy day. There's three lectures on the day, one for civil, one for criminal and one for constitutional. Um, so I'm going to head off to the Sidwick site now and just get do a little bit of work before the, uh, the lectures start and then I'll probably get on with some Roman law work uh, after the lecture. So I shall see you later. So I've had my three lectures and the civil one was continuing on the, looking at the Roman law of property and the criminal we looked at continuing with mens rea including recklessness and negligence and for constitution we continued looking at the rule of law. They were very interesting and fantastic to be listened to uh, about the law, it was very interesting. Uh, afterwards I went to the uh, Squire Law Library and did some Roman law work and managed to get what I wanted to get done completely which is fantastic so I'm going to head back now. I might stop off at Weather Springs on the way for a bit of a dessert, just a little reward for getting that uh, done and then I'll head back to college and get in with some taught work so I shall see you later on. The dessert was delicious, uh, I had my dinner and now I'm going to go to the buttery and get in with some taught law work, just a different location which would be nice so yeah I'll get in with some work and see how much I can get done. So I managed to get the taught law work that I wanted to get done in uh, completed in the buttery, which was fantastic, and it was just a, just a nice uh, different location. It's always uh, quite good to vary your locations. Uh, sometimes just um, yeah, it can be uh, be uh, definitely beneficial. Um, so yes, yeah, so I've managed to get that done. Um, I'm going to go to bed now because I've got my criminal law lecture tomorrow and my criminal law supervision tomorrow. So quite it's been quite a busy day, but uh, again, quite an important day. So I shall see you tomorrow. Good morning, it is Wednesday and today I've got my criminal law lecture and then this afternoon I've got a criminal law supervision which I've mostly prepared for, I just need to read for everything and see if there's anything I want to ask at the supervision, so yes. Not as busy as yesterday but still very important, so I shall see you later. So my lecture's not till 11 but I've decided to head off to the Sidwick site now just to get on with uh, uh, some work in preparation for the supervision as well as some taught work as well and probably get something to eat while I'm there. So we finished off the men's rear in the criminal lecture and now I've come back to college and I just need to just read over my notes for the supervision uh, that's coming up soon. I feel more confident about the supervision I guess because I know now what to expect, I haven't had one a couple of weeks ago, so yeah, I'll get ready for that, so wish me luck. So I've had my supervision for criminal law, it was really good, we went through the questions, some of the cases, so it was very helpful, cleared a couple of things up and we were able to ask questions ourselves, so that was good. So I'm going to go now to the library and get on with some uh, work uh, for taught and then I'll have some dinner later on. I've just noticed this, they are making preparations uh, out here. It must be for the 250th anniversary celebrations happening later on this week. It's not f uh, as uh, Hamilton as a college, but rather as just an, as an institution here from 1768. Uh, it's been a college rather since 2010, so this must be for the 250th anniversary happening later on. I don't think I'm going to be able to come, and I'm, the reason is I'm going to be aware, but I'll explain more about that later. I've managed to get most of the work that I wanted to get done for Roman law done. There's just a little bit in there I need to do, but I'll do that tomorrow. Uh, there would have been a supervision for constitutional um, this uh, week today, but that's been suspended until um, Saturday of the following week. So not this week, but the Saturday after. And that's because our supervisor is away. So that's when we'll be having our constitutional supervision. Um, but yeah, I've managed to get uh, some more work done. Um, I was interrupted um, briefly by the fire alarm. The fire alarm went off, so we had to stand outside in the dark, in the cold, and apparently, I don't know if this is true, apparently it was due to someone's hair dryer um, just getting too hot. <laughs> but these things happen. And you can tell when the fire alarm goes off because the fire alarm sound is very, very piercing and very, very loud. <laughs> so we had that to contend with, but then we came back and had some. Um, cups of tea in the corridor which was nice um, so that is the end of another vlog um, we are pretty much now uh, come up to half year uh, through the academic term um, so it's been quite a busy week very much busy than it was um, much more busy than it was last week a lot more work but I'm getting there and you know it's important just to plow on but you know just to take those breaks when needed um, so yes um, 
I'm going to try and do as, you know, hopefully do, do more in the next vlogs, so just, if you, uh, if just, I'm new to this, so I hope you would uh, appreciate that, and just take my time to get out uh, as I go through these vlogs, um, but yeah, but if you enjoyed this one, do like the, uh, the video, do hit that notification bell to keep up to date, don't forget to subscribe as well, be, I would appreciate the, uh, the subscribes, uh, it's just a, this channel is just a good way I can tell you about what I'm getting up to here. And if you've got any questions, you know, or any comments that you want to make, put them in the comment section below and I'll answer them as soon as I am able to. Um, but you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Um, so thank you for uh, um, being with me in this video and thank you for watching it. And I'll see you in the next one.